Mineral sunscreens are generally one of the best sunscreens to use because they can be used by filled with sensitive skin all the way to acne prone skin from a three month old baby all the way to an 80 year old man. But however, more and more people are trying not to use mineral sunscreen because of one major problem, white cast. Ladies and gentlemen, in this video, we'll be describing what is white cast and what are the top five methods to reduce the white cast in your mineral sunscreen. Hey guys, we realize that most of you are not subscribers, so if you do not mind just smashing the subscribe button, it will help the channel tremendously, pushing out videos to more and more people so that we can help more people like yourself. Hey guys, I'm Dr. Iki, your digital skin doctor, and welcome to SkinFix, the platform whereby we help you find your best skincare for your skin. Now, in today's video, we'll be showing you five methods to reduce the white cast in your physical or mineral sunscreen. You guys, before we continue with the video, what sunscreen are you using at the moment? Let me know in the comments below. What is white cast and why is it so prevalent in mineral sunscreen? First up, the white cast is actually caused by two core ingredients in mineral sunscreen or maybe in your hybrid sunscreen. The two core ingredients are zinc oxide and titanium dioxide. Now, among the both, zinc oxide actually gives you the most white cast, which is that whitish discoloration of your skin. Now, the white cast is actually important because it reflects away UV radiation, which is harmful for your skin. Hence, the white in the whitish in color. And that particular white cast or the zinc oxide will actually maximize the protection for your skin. However, if you're of a darker skin tone, like many of us living within the equatorial belt, you realize that the white discoloration or the white cast caused by mineral sunscreen or by your sunscreen can be a little bit annoying when you're trying to apply it on your skin because then you have this dual skin tone whereby your skin on your face is fair but the skin on your hands, on your neck is dark. So don't fret, so in today's video, I'll be showing you five steps to minimize or reduce the white cast caused by your sunscreen. Step number one, use a tinted sunscreen. Tinted sunscreen are actually mineral sunscreens. But what is a little bit different is they've added in things like iron oxides or zinc dioxides into the sunscreen to give it that dark hue in color. So tinted sunscreen, instead of giving them off that white cast appearance, gives off that more brownish sort of appearance. So it's great for someone with a darker skin tone. However, you do not have to worry that it gives you a lesser protection because a tinted sunscreen works as well as your mineral sunscreen. This is because the iron oxide added into your mineral sunscreen gives you the similar protection to zinc oxide and at the same time gives you maximum protection from high energy visible light. And generally, thin tinted sunscreen is suitable for all skin types, sensitive skin all the way to acne prone skin. Step number two, Pat the sunscreen on your face. One of the ways that most of us apply sunscreen is we apply the sunscreen and then we smudge it all over the face. Now, one of the ways to actually reduce the amount of white cast on your skin is instead of smudging all, all over your, your face, what you do is you apply a little bit all, all, over your fingertips and then pat it on your skin. Now, the act of patting it on your skin does not allow that streaky white cast to appear. Instead, it gives you a more even whitish tone on your skin. So yes, you're still left with a white cast or that whitish discoloration, but it wouldn't be as severe as just streaking it all over your face. Number three, time is key. Now, we all understand it's important to wear sunscreen. And unfortunately, like it or not, you have to apply it most of the time during the daytime when you're in a rush to either get to school or get to work. So more often than not, we apply the sunscreen and we just wrap it on the face and then we head out the door. Now, one of the ways to actually reduce the white cast look is to slowly rub in the sunscreen on your face for a few minutes because as you evenly apply the sunscreen and you spread the physical sunscreen on your skin, the white cast actually reduces in severity. So you should apply roughly about one quarter of a teaspoon of sunscreen to your entire face. However, don't apply the entire quarter teaspoon at the same time. What you can do is you can portion it out, apply a small bit of it first on your face, and then after one to two minutes, apply a little bit more over the top. And keep topping it up until you've done the quarter of a teaspoon. Even though it might take some time, maybe up to five to 10 minutes to evenly apply the sunscreen on your face, 
the results are definitely worth it. Four, layer your sunscreen if you must. Now, even though it's not generally recommended to blend your sunscreen with other products or to probably put something on top of your sunscreen, but one of the ways to reduce the white cast is to put makeup on top of your sunscreen. Now, one of the favorite tips that I've asked a lot of makeup artists is they usually put a bronzer on top of their physical sunscreen. Now, what the bronzer does is actually gives your skin that nice, natural skin tone. We also recommend to use a more liquid form or a, a form of powder form makeup when you're applying sunscreen on your face and avoid those lotion-based makeups. And the fifth of all, allow the sunscreen to set on your skin. The white cast is generally very obvious during the first five to 10 minutes of applying your mineral sunscreen. Now, one of the things is you can actually just leave it on your skin, allow it time to blend into your skin by not doing anything. Within the first five to 10 minutes, the white cast actually reduces in severity. Now, there are many physical sunscreens in the market that actually reduces severity of the white cast as time goes by. So guys, there you have it five ways to reduce the white cast of your sunscreen. If you like this video, please click the like button. Comment below what other tips and methods that you use to reduce the white cast in your skin. And do not forget to subscribe, turn on the bell button, and let your friends and family know about this video as well. That's it from me. I'm Dr. Inky, your digital skin doctor. And always remember to stay safe, stay healthy, and most importantly, stay informed. Are you tired of wasting time and money on your skin, but nothing works? We are here to help. SkinFix is a platform that provides personal care education completely free. SkinFix is run by skin doctors and skincare experts. You can chat and consult with our skin doctors without ever leaving your home. Other than free advice, SkinFix also provides tailor-made solutions for your skin problem with customized medical-grade skincare delivered right to your doorstep. SkinFix, your digital skin doctor.